Welcome to Ponderize, the channel where we help you improve your study of conference talks. Today we will go over study questions for Sister Raina I. Alberto's talk entitled, We Are the Church of Jesus Christ of Latter-day Saints. I invite you to grab something to take notes with and answer these questions as we go. Also, feel free to pause as needed. These questions are perfect for personal study, but you may also want to discuss these questions at your next family council, quorum meeting, release society lesson, or group hangout. Now, let's get into it. Question number one. Sister Berto says, when I entered the church building, I was filled with warmth as I perceived the faith and joy of people surrounding me. It was truly a refuge from the storm. For you, when has going to church been like a refuge from the storm? For the next part, how did the members affect your experience inside the church compared to just being in an empty church? For question number two, Sister Alberto says, I made the baptismal covenant with Heavenly Father and started my journey as a disciple of Christ, although my life has not been perfect along that journey. In a way, she is saying that members of the church aren't perfect. Why is that important to remember? Now, what about the church is perfect? Question number three, for me to receive those eternal blessings, many physical and spiritual elements had to be in place. That's something Sister Alberto mentioned in her talk. And then she goes on to list the elements that she said had to be in place. She lists how the gospel had to be preached, chapels had to be built, and leaders and callings had to be given. So why is it important that we contribute to all these elements? Question number four, she says, from the beginning, God has sought to gather and organize his children. Using the footnotes here at this part, think of some times that God tried to organize his children. When were those times? For the next part of this question, why is organizing his children important to him, him being God? All right, for question number five. A friend that was being blessed by fast offerings said to Sister Alberto, I don't know where my family and I would be if it wasn't for the church. Sister Alberto told him, the church is the members. They are the ones who willingly and joyfully give fast offerings. Now consider sharing why you have a testimony of fast offering donations. For question number six, the Lord has said, Behold, this is my doctrine. Whosoever repenteth and cometh unto me, the same is my church. 
What does repentance have to do with being a part of the church? Question number seven. Mr. Berto says, let us realize how privileged we are to belong to the church of Jesus Christ. The question is, why do you come to church? What makes you grateful for the church? Question number eight. Mr. Berto says, our purpose in his kingdom should be to bring each other to Christ. The Savior said, have ye any that are afflicted in any manner? Bring them hither and I will heal them. How do you feel as you read the Savior's words? And why did Christ use the words afflicted in any manner? Question number nine, we can bring each other to the Savior's redeeming healing, says Sister Alberto. Question is, have you ever been helped by someone to come closer to the Lord? Has someone ever helped you along that covenant path, brought you nearer to the Savior? Question number 10, how can you help someone come closer to the Lord and to his church this week? All right, that's it for this video. Thanks for following along and answering those questions. Um, if you liked it, please like and subscribe, even if you didn't like it. Like and subscribe anyways. Fill the world with positivity. Have a great one.